Hi guys, you are on Smile IS platform. Today I am going to discuss current affair 18th July 2022. Our tagline is Veer Bhoge Vashundara means those who are hardworking, ambitious, they can achieve anything, whatever they want. Today is presidential election, so our topic is start with the presidential election. Presidential President Vice President Election Act 1952 What it said uh, Election can be issued by Election Commission on and after the 60th 30th day before the expiry of term of office of ongoing president S 60 days okay means when 60 days left or less than 60 days election commission can issue for election okay you can see here election can can be issued by the election commission constitutional provision related to election president of india is is elected by the member of electoral college okay what is electoral college electoral college consists of a both house uh, of parliament means Lok Sabha and uh, Rajya Sabha elected member of legislative assemblies means state legislative assemblies of state including you see here it is not union it says legislative assemblies of state including new del new capital territory of Delhi okay and union territory of Puducherry you can see here it is not include other union territory delhi and pudu uh, puducherry because um, these two union territory has a uh, uh, assemblies okay this was included in 70th uh, amendment act 1992 okay and under article 44 as well it is written the member some member are nominated in the at uh, in Lok Sabha, Raja Sabha and in the legislative assemblies okay they are they are not eligible uh, they are not uh, they are not able to vote for the in this election okay you can see here the member nominated to either house of parliament legislative assemblies of the state including NCT of Delhi Union Territory of Puducherry are not eligible to be included in the electoral college okay here uh, they say that uniformity talk about uniformity representation of different state at election okay uh, for securing such uniformity among the state inter say well parity between the state as a whole and the union a formula based on a population of each state is given in the constitution for determination of value of vote which each elected member of parliament and of the legislative legislative assembly of each state is entitled to cost means if there is a for example uh, up has 80 seat up has 80 seat in the its state as uh, uh, in lok sabha and uh, it has uh, in state its legislative this is 80 seat for parliament uh, uh, lok sabha and plus 32 seat in Raj Sabha. This is total uh, 1, 1, 2. Okay. And its state has approximately 4, not 3 seat. They, this one, they, they are representing the same population. So, the division should be in such a way that the vote value of all the f all the four not three uh, MLA vote and 
all 112 mp vote should be equal so it talks about that one okay constituent 84th amendment act 2000 provide that until the relevant population figure here they are saying that because what happened the census 1971 the census after that there is a freeze in the population even population increase there is no counting for the purpose of uh, uh, deciding the seat of mp okay because every time the seat change due to uh, population but after 71 there is a freeze it is because uh, some southern state and some other state where there is a no growth of population they are saying that we are controlling population here and and what we get in uh, what we get by reducing population is our seat is reducing because uh, in 1951 after that 1961 after that 1971 these three senses their seat is reduced and that says some st um, some state are not doing their job and we de we did our job and you are punishing us so that's why this is a freeze and in 2000 it was also freezed okay uh, because every 10 year it was freezed no population will use for the purpose of seat okay and uh, this was postponed up to 2026 okay till the seat is decided by the 1971 census okay here you can see the example okay uh, a total population of andhra pradesh okay 1971 2 crore 78 lakh 586 okay uh, in state assembly seat is 75 so what you have to do is here uh, this whole population and here 1000 uh, by and this one state assembly 75 there is a answer is 158.8605 so approximately 159 means one mla vote number of votes for each member one one mla vote वन एम ले वोट इक्वल वन फिफ्टी नाइन ऑफ फॉर आंध्र प्रदेश ओके एवरी स्टेट हैज डिफरेंट बिकॉज ऑफ द डिफरेंट पॉपुलेशन फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू नो फॉर यूपी इज द हाइएस्ट एंड द सिक्किम इज द लोएस्ट सिक्किम इज द लोएस्ट फॉर वोट पर्पज ओके बिकॉज ऑफ द पॉपुलेशन here again the explaining this one okay a statement showing the value of vote for each member of legislative assembly is 28 state and city of delhi and union territory of puducherry total value of a vote of each state of the said state the value of vote each member of parliament and total value of vote of mp and the grand total they are saying that mp plus uh, both mp for a uh, uh, full parliament okay raj sabha as well as lok sabha is equal to mla of whole india okay mla of whole india the vote of both together are equal okay system of proportional representation in our presidential system we follow since system of proportional representation by mean of single transferable vote okay so what happen in this uh, there are maybe uh, this way there are six candidate okay this is 1 this is 2 this is 3 this is 4 this is 5 this is 6 there is a six candidate okay so you want to vote this one single transferable means 
you want this one first one you want okay this one and then you want a second if this sort is not gone to him then goes to him if this sort is not gone to him you say okay this vote goes home so you decide your root is all six preferences decided okay so in this way vote is transfer that is saying single transferable vote means priority first one then second one then say third one fourth one like this okay election shall be held in accordance with the system of proportional representation by mean of single transferable vote and the voting at such uh, election shall be by secret ballot okay means box secret ballot the manner of voting presidential is contained in rule number 17 a presidential and vice presidential election rule 1974 okay the ballot paper does not contain any election symbol okay there is a two column one is a name of candidate and second one is order of preference means you choose first one you choose then third then sixth then fifth then second in this way okay quota for election after calculating the total value of vote hold by each candidates the returning officer told total of the value of all valid votes hold the quota for declaring candy declaring a candidates as elected is determined by dividing the valid votes by 2 and adding 1 to the quotient ignoring the remainder if any for example assuming the total value of valid votes hold by all candidate is this the quota required for getting is you have to do this this is for example purpose okay you have to do it and then add it this is one ignore in 50 because you have to round figure here uh, 50000 is here the quota okay eligibility for the election no person shall be eligible for the election of president unless he is the citizen of india complete the the age of of uh, 35 year a uh, qualified for the election of member of house of the people okay a person shall not be eligible for an election a person shall not be eligible for the election as president if he if he see hold office of profit okay means you are in any government job or anything government where you taken taking profit you can leave that job or that post then you can okay there is exception for some post in india the government if you are the uh, if you are the what is of either you can see the uh, government of india and government of any state under any local authority subjected to control any of the state government okay the these exception i am talk about is for governor for president for vice president okay president vice president and then governor or is minister either a, a state assembly or union or uh, uh, here for union as well okay miscellaneous a prospective presidential candidate shall get his and her nominees paper subscriber at least 50 elector as a proposer and at least uh, 50 elector as a seconder uh, if you see the video they are all the prime minister all the minister all the chief minister went with the 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 nominate candy candidate up for election uh, president uh, for both opposition as well as um, main uh, go government candidate or the party candidate in the case of prospective vice president candidate the nomination paper should be subscribed by at least 20 elector okay in case of vice president okay at least 20 as a proposer and at least 20 as a seconder whether proposer or seconder more than one nomination paper has same election and if he does her signature shall be inoperative means these people will be first uh, proposer and seconder should be different okay if they they are in both they will be their signature shall be inoperative okay one first delivered okay prospective candidate should deposit some of 
fifteen thousand as a security deposit. This amount is liable to be forfeited if election shall taken. Candidate is not elected and no number of valid votes polled by such candidate is not exceeded one sixth of the vote necessary to secure the return of candidate at such election. Okay, means you have to win election or you have to get get more than one sixth. Okay, of vote. Otherwise, your money will be forfeited. A money, okay, that is not big, just fifteen thousand. Uh, an election petition means if there is any issue, if you think that there is a some issue, something is not happen as not followed, some some there is issue, some in result of presidential election or in voting time, you can complain with, with the election petition in Supreme Court. It is the uh, it is exclusive exclusive jurisdiction of supreme court okay in case of office of vice president the candidate such election and 10 and more electors join together as a petitioner okay in this uh, that 21 or uh, 20 or more join together as a petitioner but in case of a vice president 10 or more left to join together as a petition you already read about if you not get one sixth of vote uh, the money is forfeited and here is second is sabang port it is located at malacca state in indonesia okay you just need to know about where this port is okay and especially in the state pcs and sometime in the upsc they ask such question okay or may they ask uh, about order from uh, east to west so they gave many port name and they ask such INS Sindhu Dhwaj a diesel electric submarine of Indian Navy it was decommissioned from Navy okay so it is in today's news so that's why I thought you need to know what is Sindhu Dhwaj thank you have a nice day I hope you like share and subscribe thank you